Hey, what's good? I hope everyone is doing well. So in this video, I'll be playing Red Dead Redemption 2 on RTX 4070 Super. And whoa, this game looks super beautiful on this card. Uh, this is the first time I'm playing this game on uh, extreme settings. And uh, I'm, I'm, just, I'm running this game on 1080p monitor, but using uh, 120 resolution scale. So this game looks more crispy on our 1080p monitor and it is just super beautiful to play this game on on a high-end card and please note that uh, since I'm recording with OBS uh, I'm getting about about 12 to 15 frames less right now otherwise game uh, runs on 100 for about 100 frames most of the times so let me show you the settings the settings I'm using to run this game so I'm I'm uh, using extreme settings except two options here and these two are uh, really killing frames a lot so I decided to turn them uh, a bit lower so the first setting that is killing frames is this reflection quality so as soon as I turn this to ultra it was getting about 10 to 12 frames so I decided to push this to high high box perfect and the other setting that I turned lower is the water physics I don't know why uh, this setting also affects the the area where there is no water so as soon as you turn this to uh, extreme it will kill the frames so I turn to put this uh, a notch lower than the extreme and here uh, to get the cle uh, cleanest possible image and clear uh, crispy graphics I'm using I'm using resolution scale of uh, 1.25 times so it is 100% of, uh, of my resolution plus 25% more more clear more crispy more immersive and TA sharpening about five notches one two three four five everything else is extreme let me show you the anti-aliasing options I'm using uh, TA set to medium I saw a video on YouTube where uh, that guy showed completely uh, how this option works and on uh, high TA it makes uh, surroundings a bit blurry so that's why I'm using it on medium so that's pretty much it uh, let's see the gameplay and please uh, again I'm I'm letting you know that uh, OBS is killing frames so I get about 100 frames without OBS So I'll mute myself and we'll just see the gameplay without any commentary. Starved to death up here, Mr. Morgan. We're okay. We have a few cans of food and a rabbit. For what? 10, 12 people? When I was in the Navy. I, I do not wish to hear about what you got up to in the Navy, Mr. Pearson. We were stranded at sea for 50 days. And you unfortunately survived. When we ran away from Blackwater, I wasn't able to get supplies in. Well, when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short. We'll survive. We always have. If needs be, we can eat you. You're the fattest. 
I sent Lenny and Bill hunting, and they found nothing. Well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting. Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found Enough nothing. Enough of this. We'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. Wait a second. Hold on. Uh, here. You're gonna need something to eat out there. Assorted salted offal. Starving would be preferable. Come on, let's go. You can't go hunting. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. Look, if this game in those hills, I'll find it. And you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? Come along. <coughs> Here, you take this. I can't use it, and you'll have to. Oh, you're joking. Use a gun, and we'll scare off every animal for miles around. You're never too old to learn, I imagine. All right, let's head out. How are you holding up, Charles? I'm okay, apart from this hand. Stupid mistake. Still bad? It'll be fine in a day or two. I just can't pull a bow right now. I uh, sure hope I can. Never really got the hang of it. You'll be fine. <sighs> so, you reckon we're gonna find something to kill that ain't no Driscoll? Huh. There's meat up here for sure. Pearson doesn't know what he's talking about. Now the weather's eased off a bit, they'll be needing to feed. We'll head up this way, find some higher ground. Whew. Been a wild few days, all right. That ride north from Blackwater, getting stuck in the storm, bringing John back in. You've had a lot put on you. I wish I could have done more. I didn't mean it like that, just a lot to think back on. I still don't really know what happened on that boat. Me neither. <laughs> well, Javier told me a bit, but it sure weren't good. Some patches of grass here. This is good. Let's look down this way. Move it, come on. <laughs> Arthur, you need to stay with me. <laughs> Winds died down too. That's good. No wind at all is bad, but if it's too strong, they won't move. Now shh. Stay quiet. Hey, stop here a second. I see something. Deer been here and recently. How can you tell? How can you not? Let's walk it from here. You're gonna need the bow. Don't leave it on your horse. The gun will scare everything around. Quiet as you can. 
Stay low and move slowly. Keep your head down. You see the tracks? I uh, think so. Maybe not. Focus. There they are. Are you ready with that bow? Try to hit him in the neck or in the eyes. See if you can get another one. Take your time. Done. I think that's all we can carry. Okay, you pick up one, I'll get the other. You sure your hands are okay? Uh, it'll be fine once I get it on my shoulder. Okay, I'll go grab the other one. back when you are. Come on, then. Let's head back. <laughs> nice work, Arthur. Should be enough meat here to keep us all fed for a few days. You found him. <laughs> I knew you'd be okay with that bow. It's easier when they ain't shooting back. <laughs> We've seen enough of that. 
Considering how things were looking a couple of days back, well, maybe our luck is finally on the turn. Seems to me we should be putting our effort into getting off this mountain now. Soon. People are still weak, and well, you've seen how snowed in those wagons are. They ain't going nowhere until we get some more thaw. Mm, you're probably right. And even if we do get off here, what that? We still have a big price on our heads. This is a big country. We'll find somewhere to lie low. Dutch and Jose will have a plan. You notice how Pearson's had a bottle in his hand ever since we fled Blackwater? We give the camp cook five minutes to grab the essentials and go, and he doesn't even bring a crumb of food. Good that we caught more than one. A lot of mouths to feed. And that girl from the ranch now, too, but not sure she'll be eating much. She has a wild look in her eye. You would, too. She lost her husband, her home, everything she had. Huh. So what do we do with her? Once we get out of here and we're back on our feet, we'll see. She might have family somewhere. So it was O'Driscoll's you ran into there? Yeah. <laughs> Last thing we was expecting. What is it with the O'Driscoll's? You ain't dealt with them? I suppose. Hell, we ain't run into them much the last six months. I guess because they've been over this way. Yeah. I've heard a lot of talk about them. Well, we've been scrapping over scores with them for years. Big gang. Nasty sons of bitches. Their leader, Cone, and Dutch go way back. And not in a good way. A proper blood feud. So I heard. Bear up ahead. Let's see if we can find another way around. You must be real hungry. Stay well back. Spring storms like this are the worst for animals that sleep all winter. much you and me how long you been with us now five six months something like that they didn't expect this what any of this black water mess being up here ah uh, sooner or later a job's gonna go wrong nature of life i just thought you might have moved on by now you want me to move on no no not at all I just no, you could run it alone, no problem. I did that for a long time. I'm done with it. Always wondering if someone's gonna kill you in your sleep. I still wonder that most nights. <laughs> I reckon you're okay. This suits me. Sure, I could fall in with another gang, but Dutch. You know, Dutch is different. Oh yes, Dutch is certainly different. He treats me fair. Most of you do. And for a fellow with a black father and an Indian mother, that ain't normally the case. Well, we need you now. Or never. Good. And how long have you been with these boys? Why ain't you run off? Me? Oh, 20 years, something like that. Since I was a boy. 20 years? Yeah. <laughs> Taught me to read. John, too. 
Tell me a few other things, him and Hosea. Huh. I'm sure. Just saved me. Saved most of us. That's why we need to stick by him through this. He always sees us right. How's that new horse? He's all right. He'll do for now. I appreciate you letting me take Taima the other night. She's a strong one. It's been as hard on the horses as on the rest of us. I don't know what Dutch would do if something happened to the Count. Same with Bill and Brown Jack. He's a drunk, miserable bastard, but he loves that horse. Huh. I hope they all make it. I tried to ride the Count once. Fuck me faster than a bull. Won't take nobody but him. I'm gonna hitch time over here. Grab some food back, boys! Come on, let's get these over to Pearson. Oh, yeah. Thank you for showing me how to use the bow properly. I only showed you a little. It takes a lifetime of practice to master. 